that's a Gila monster. It's uh, probably over a foot from the tip of his nose to the end of his tail. But you notice how much they blend in so easily with the backdrop. Ruger! Long, slow grind of working on this place is just starting. Putting the floor in. Yeah, putting in uh, Max R or R Max. Um, two pieces down there. And I got uh, this board here, nice tight fit. I have to come back and cock up that in just a little bit. Of course, that's the end that I cut, so. It's in there nice and tight. And I got the uh, um, hardware cloth all folded up and attached to the side. I still need to work on. It's done all the way around, but this side's been folded over and then folded up. The other side I just wrapped it up and tacked it in because I was I was getting exhausted last night. So and since I don't have to worry about rain for the next week anyway, I'm not worried about putting the caulking on. I figure I'll let everything settle down and do what it's gonna do before I go out there and start caulking stuff. But uh, yeah, this is a site I wanna eventually put a porch on. Uh, well a deck I should say. And then I'll take this thing out so I can walk out here. That's not going to be for a year or two or whenever. I pretty much decided that I'm going to have to do this with a spray foam insulation. Since there was no soffit vents anywhere, I uh, had to delete the cable vents. And, oh, there's no ridge vent up there. So, and pretty much means I gotta do the spray foam up there, I believe. Oh, I haven't seen up there. But I'm gonna do it up there towards the top, and then maybe come back and stain these cross beams, and leave them exposed. I don't know. They're not that pretty, but I figure if I stain them a nice color, they'll come out looking nice. I don't know. We'll see. Almost done with the floor. That's done over there, that's just an extra piece. I still got uh, two more four by eight sheets of flooring to put down. It was too windy to bring them over. So they're gonna stay in the green trailer tonight. I'll do it in the morning. I'm exhausted anyway. So, I'm getting there.
I was stressing a little bit, thinking I was going to have to get some sawhorses or something for doing this sort of stuff. But I just used what I had. A nice stable base for doing all my cutting. Got to measure and cut these final two pieces and then the flooring is, well, other than the carpeting and the padding and <laughs> all that sort of stuff, the flooring will be done. Making progress. And that's how I do that. This is from my front porch. This is the view you get from here. And look at that, there's a swirl.
Yep, this is the view I get. Beautiful in the morning. Watching the sun rising on those mountains. Oh, it was always my favorite view when they had the motorhome facing this direction. Well, I was watching the sunrise racing down those mountains and towards this direction.